You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. The City of Pikeville's Winterfest attraction is still open and running at the City Park in downtown through the end of the year. Earlier, we sat down with Director of Tourism for the City of Pikeville, Jimmy Taylor, for more information. Winterfest ice skating in our beautiful city park uh, lasts from, it starts on Shop Small Saturday and lasts till January the 1st. Uh, we are open Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sundays, uh, different times, Thursday and Friday, 3 to 9, Saturday, 10 to 9, and Sunday, 12 to 6. Uh, we host uh, a lot of school groups, a lot of church groups, and uh, some of the employers from around here send their employees over to have some good times too. With affordable rates, the Winterfest ice skating attraction offers a unique chance for residents and their families to enjoy a one-of-a-kind activity that's only available in Pikeville through the end of the year. $10 for adults, $6 for kids 6 and under, uh, group rates, uh, let's say you want to take your school group, uh, those are $15, but that also includes skates, skate time, uh, pizza, popcorn, and soda. The only time that Winterfest is closed is Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. We're open New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. Uh, it's a great time. Uh, it's a great time to have everybody come out and have some of that quality family time that people uh, really do like and enjoy. Winterfest is a great time. Uh, we have had tremendous success with our school groups. Uh, from December the 1st all the way through the 23rd, our calendar was full up with the uh, kids coming and skating. Uh, our biggest group has been 97 and our smallest group we've hosted seven. So we host a variety of, of groups that want to come and have fun and uh, it, it's a great time. All the kids have fun. I make sure they have a great time and I know that they do. For Mountain Talk News, I'm Joshua Sloan.